basically these are things that I sell it's not always going to be lashes you may see some shirts you may see some lingerie you may see, I don't know what you may see on there so I, I did the logo so I, I, I finally found someone I thought was reputable. I didn't feel, I didn't want to do it through Cash App, so I did through PayPal instead. And um, he he really, it, it was everything that I wanted. He, he did it earlier than what he said he was going to do and he contacted me every step of the way. He asked for my favorite colors. Um, you know things like that he, he was just very professional i keep saying he it could have been a she but um <coughs> i i did that and also i just went to staples i'm y'all i'm a staples girl i am truly a staples girl i just went to staples and i would like a magnetic decal that advertises exclusive a lash and you know um exclusive a lash and things that that's my um brand and basically these are things that i sell it's not always going to be lashes you may see some shirts you may see some lingerie you may see, i don't know what you may see on there so I would like another advertising tool since I'm always seems to be driving. Um, I would like it to go on the back of my doors. So it's ve it was very affordable at Staples. Very, very affordable to have them do that for me. Give them, I gave them my logo. They they did it how I wanted it. They they put in extra wording because you have to understand your logo is just your logo. If your logo is wink it and blink it, it's wink it and blink it. Not a lot of stuff is gonna be underneath that. You may have your slogan underneath that, but it's not gonna be something you have to just add in. So they did that for me. I ordered two and with my luck they, they said it's going to be here in four days so i did that what else have i invested into this lashes the next investment um I, so to do the staples for my car the um the advertising banners to go on the doors you know those peel off things to go on the doors was um with taxes it came up to 51 dollars for my logo um, with the transparent um, background to put on videos and things like that, that was $100. So I'm already at $150. The next thing I have to spend on with this company is my YouTube channel. I have finally found someone to do my intro, my outro, and my banner. <sighs> Y'all. I'm, I'm not a HTML creative web. I'm not like that. So I have to go to the people who do that, who, who, who know how to take it there. You get them your vision and they be like, okay, voila. That's what I need. Because if it's up to me, y'all, and I've looked into this stuff, it may take me days just to get to point A. Like it is really, it is in a world, a, a totally different world. So that's my next venture guys. Um, other than that, I think I've told you everything. Um, that is the only thing that I know of right now. I haven't gotten my shirt made because yes, I do want a shirt with my logo on it and things like that. I haven't gotten that made yet, but I imagine that's not gonna be a lot of money. Um, when I do do the lashes though, 
this is what I go with. This is something I got off of AliExpress too. I like this little cosmetic box. So I still have some lashes in here. Let me pull out some stuff that's in here. So I have a mirror in here that I usually give my customers to look down at. A little NARS um, mirror. I have some synthetic lashes. Cause it's it's funny how a lot of people um I don't know. I guess I just show them because a lot of people like for me, I'm I'm gonna tell you guys I charge fifteen dollars for my lash. I have um one for fifteen and two for twenty-five. And if the and these are only five dollars a pair. Okay, and I'll usually show them the synthetic and the minks, and then they like, you know, they talk, they look trash, like, oh no, this. Mm -mm. I have some Q-tips to wipe up the glue or <coughs> or excess glue. I have my scissors. I have bonding glue. I have duo glue in here. Now, I really don't apply with the bonding glue, but I have certain customers, that's what they want. That's, hey, we're not gonna argue with the bonding glue. I'll give you the bonding glue. And this is a tray of the newest lashes that I have. I actually took it out of this box. I haven't even packaged it yet. So I have to take these out and package them. Let me tell you, let me just show you how they came. because they actually, it was like, these are cheaper. They come in just a clear tray. We're not, you know, this is how they come. If you want um, us to customize it, we could charge you extra. I said, no, send that tray just like that because I got something to go in the back. I'm trying to make money, not spend it. So this is how theirs came from one of the vendors. This is some very dramatic, dramatic lashes. So. That's my roommate, y'all. Sorry about that. I'm gonna put that label right in the back of there, and it's fine because it's a, once you take it out, you just you can still take it out, and you're good money. So I just wanted to show you guys that sometimes it is okay if the lashes come like that. It's it's a bob. It's okay. It's not gonna kill us. So that's the, the bag that I carry. And what I have to buy is um, some customers I find that it's better to line their eyes so that they because when, when you don't line a customer's eyes when you're putting their lashes on, they like to look like this and they like to see, you'll see the strip. And they're like, oh, I don't know if the glue is. So with some customers, it's just best to line their eyes with the, with the angled liner and some gel, and some gel liner and boom. And then you apply their lash. So, so that's something that that's something I need to put in here. Little black gel liner and an angled brush just for my customers. But other than that, this is all I have. This is my little professional setup that I got going on. What? Okay, and I also have some of the newer lashes in. I got some new ones. I need to revise this because this is not ready. I don't have the labels on it. I, you know what it was? I think I was so excited when I got this that, that, that everything else was done. I just feel so good carrying around my thing like I'm a whole MUA. Okay, so let me just put these lashes are going to be called Tokyo. Tokyo. So I just peeled one off for Tokyo. Let 
I'm gonna keep the thing on. I'm keeping this whole. Should I take it off? Let's see. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be more work because I gotta put stuff back. And you place it right over the number. Place it right over the number. So they'll know that's all you. That's all you, boo boo. That is all you. Okay? And make sure when you do your labels, you have your Instagram thing or however. Make you a Facebook page. And you're good to go. You are good to go. Another thing. I think I've told you guys everything. Another thing, guys. Don't get overwhelmed. This is a hobby. This is supposed to be fun. Okay? This is, this is fun. 